Hello. So I have a fun puzzle for you. There is a link in the description if you'd like to try it yourself. Uh, and this comes from The Asylum, who is utilizing the brand new Super Supporter perk. Um, for those who don't know, I have reorganized and, and changed the perks for all of my membership levels, uh, YouTube memberships. So that is that join button uh, under the video, or you can go to uh, youtube.com slash ranks slash join. Uh, link for that is in the description as well, and that would let you join as a member. There are three tiers. There is the uh, early access tier, which is the cheapest, just $5 a month. And the big thing you get from that is early access to almost all of my videos. Um, as soon as I record and upload them, you get to watch them. You don't have to wait until I release them uh, later in the day. Um, and then uh, there is also the enthusiast tier, which gets, uh, in, in addition to, of course, the previous tier, uh, gets a discount on my merch, 10% discount. And then the super supporter tier, which is $25 a month, um, which is crazy that uh, people want to support me at that level, but uh, a few of them do, which I very much thank them for at the end of every video now. So you do get a shout out at the end of every video uh, uh, for all my super supporters at that current time. And uh, also you get to do puzzle submissions. So uh, that's what the Asylum has jumped on doing. Uh, the Asylum has been a super supporter for 25 months, if you believe it, and is also a good friend of mine. So uh, very much appreciate the Asylum support. So I'm very happy to do this puzzle uh, that he created. And actually, it is a gauntlet of Wordles. Uh, using his own custom Wordle uh, website called Wordle Later. Uh, uh, there's a link in the description if you want to try it yourself. Um, and I'm going to get started. And what I'm going to do is, uh, the Asylum actually encouraged me to do this, is uh, he has come up with starting word pairs for length 5 through 15 words. So if you're ever presented with a Wordle of a particular length, you can use this starting word pair and you'll uh, have uh, good success, uh, at least set yourself up for success there. So uh, for length 5, uh, I have my notes here, but uh, the Asylum suggests starting and with noisy. Oh, well, there it is. <laughs> Come on, what else would it be? All right, so it is giving us the next link here. So I'm going to go to that. But the other, the next word would be hot or hot or however that's pronounced, H-O-H-A-U-T-E. All right, length 6 is botany. You might notice I've used some of these uh, for uh, polygonal solves. And then cruise. So you can see it gets us 10 unique letters and all the vowels plus Y. All right, well, we have all our letters, actually. Um, so what is this word? N uh, nature. Nice. All right, we're off to a good start. Let's move on to length seven. <laughs> can probably start guessing what these URLs are, but we don't need to. All right, so right length seven is poultry and maidens. All right, not quite all the info on this one, but we, we're off to a good start. Um, okay, so what, what's this T doing? Is it is it TY? So what's nice about here is I don't have to use filler X's. I can just click on the individual slots. So this is ILY. I'm thinking TY at the end. Maybe ATY? Illity. Um, hmm. Maybe maybe not. Maybe it's like a something I L. Hmm. Oh, ability. Nice. Cool. That's a good one. All right. What a what great ability you're demonstrating. Oh, I should be reading these as I go. Sorry about that. All right. Here's the next one. Um. So for eight, <coughs> we have. This is where I have to um really look it up because I don't remember these. But angelfish. Oh no. Sorry. Eight. Sorry, eight I do know. Robustly. I, I skipped ahead to nine. <laughs> Robustly machined. I use this all the time in polygonal. It's great. All right. Um, and Robustly Machined uses 15 unique, or sorry, 16 unique letters, which is insane. Um, somehow we didn't get all of them, though. So I think he designed these to work well with his starts, but not give it away, which is cool. Um, obviously, put a lot of thought into this. Um, So what do I do here? Uh, well, we know this is a C. Let's see. This is not U or H. So if it's one of our existing letters, it's I or N. I wonder if there's repeated letters here. Ooh, yeah. I don't. I don't know. To, I don't know what letters go where, and we don't have all that much info. So it's tough. Um, what, what's going to go before this C is kind of my first question. 
we only have U's and I's available. So this this is almost certainly a U or an I. So we're not doing like SC or anything like that. So let, let's look at IC, I guess, just to have something there. Um, our available letters are some of the less common ones, but maybe I was thinking about like picture or something, but there's no T, right? But pic, maybe, maybe, oh, it can't be picnic. We need, we need to use the, because of the I there, we need to use the U and the H. Um, I might, uh, I might do a filler though. So this, I, I like, even though the I can't be here, I like the repeated I to see how many there are. So I don't know if we can finish picnic though. How about picnicker? I know it's not great, but we have infinite guesses. So we are not in danger of losing here. All right. There are two I's. That's good to know. There's also two C's. So I'm, I'm probably right about there being a lot of repeated letters here. So obviously that's still a C. Um, and then we need another C somewhere. So maybe it's like ICH at the end somehow. Oh, how about I N C? Oh no, it can't be I N C H. We tried the N here. Um, unless it was I N. Oh, it can't be I N C H here either. Okay, I thought maybe that would work, but um, okay. What else can we do? We could do U C H here. Uh, I I don't know. Ending in C H is is a little bit difficult unless there's another consonant, but um. I wonder if sandwich, I think sandwich will be helpful just to see if that ends in ch. So I'm kind of struggling. It does not end in ch. We found this I though. So we know where one of the I's goes. Um, oh yeah, this is almost certainly a U just because it's not the I. And I think we, we are going to need a vowel there, although I could be wrong. Um, there's no S. So we're not a plural. Hmm, I wonder if there's a CK involved here, like uh, not luck. Um, maybe it's an ing word. Ooh, it's probably an ing word. Oh, I see duckling, but there's no d or l. Um, there's an h somewhere. Huck. Huck. <laughs> I don't think maybe it's not ck. Let's look at this ing though. There's another i. So the other i would go here, and then we need an h. Ing, ing or <laughs> this isn't right. Um, I think I, I think I'll I'll do duckling to see if I'm on the right track at all. Ooh, it's not ing, but I have the in here. Um, hmm. So in what? It could be in i. That might be interesting, but. Not INH, not INC. Oh, weird. This is not H. So the H, the H almost certainly goes. Maybe the H could go here or it could go here. Um, so I need another I somewhere. I feel like it's got to be here. Or, or at the end. Maybe it's at the end. Because mm. what else would go there? A U? Let's see how. Um, well, this one's a tough one. <laughs> what am I not thinking about? I really feel like the I works better there, but I don't know what to end with then. An H somewhere. Huse, Huse, Hin something. There's two C's. Hold on. There's two C's. Where's the other C go? Can it end in INC? Or are we doing like two C's maybe? Oh. Two C's might work. And then that means that this would be the I. We need an H. Hold on. Something like that. Wait, it accepted that. That's a word? Okay. U C C H I N I. Oh, fucini? Is that a pasta? Oh, it accepted that too. Um, oh, zucchini. Oh, that is that is hard. Wow. Okay, got it. <laughs> no clever pun here. Sorry, that's okay. It's a tough, tough one for sure. I, I don't, I'm not sure why I accepted some of those other ones. <laughs> All right. So for nine, I already uh, gave that away, but it's angelfish, and then byproduct. 
Oh, so uh, that's nice. It's something produce. <laughs> um, hmm. What kind of produce? Could be could involve another O, U, or E. We produce. I would accept that. <laughs> Maybe it's accepting anything. Um, it seems like it is. Let's see. So what goes there? Oh, reproduce. Duh. Okay. <laughs> All right, got it. Should have gotten that in three. That's right. Can you reproduce these results? <laughs> All right, number 10. We've got blacksmith and gunpowdery. He tried to design these to be memorable so you can remember them. It's kind of neat uh, how we put in the work to come up with these word pairs. Um, now, <laughs> there's there's a B not at the start. Um, okay, so we've got B A C N O I T. These are the these are the letters we've got. So we either need some new letters or a lot of repeats. Um, ooh, it's it's tough. Uh, Taco Bell, <laughs> no. Taco Bell, no. Okay, it is accepting anything. That's helpful. All right, we do have a B here. Um, what are what are we doing here? It's it's really hard to think of ten letter words, so I'm probably going to do some more nonsense to be honest. Um, I didn't use the I in that guess. It couldn't have been Taco Bell. No, sorry. Um, yeah, having the I here doesn't help me a whole lot. Taco is involved. <laughs> probably not in that order. Um, all right, what about like? Like what's going around? Let's going around this B. I wonder if I should focus on that. Like this isn't an O, so probably an A or an I. Let's try A. There's ah, uh, there's no L's. Yeah, we knew that. Um, bint. Um, there's one O. Maybe like T O N at the end. So like Binton. <laughs> um, I'm gonna do another filler, I'm sure of it. Uh, let's see. So I did Binton. Uh, ca uh, cab. Ca I'm gonna do Catabinton. <laughs> Whatever that would be. <laughs> nice. Okay, I got two T's placed. I got the B I. Oh, okay. So it's not O N. There's one N, and it's really limited where it can go now. I wonder if it's like ant. Um, that would make sense to an extent. This wouldn't be an O. We need a C somewhere. Um, ooh. Where does the C go? So ant, and then this would be probably anti. Oh, anti. Bic. Anti. What else do I know? <laughs> It, we could have new letters. Um, let's see, can we have new letters? So what do I still need to use? I used this. I didn't use the C. Anti, bict, or like maybe it's ends in C. Antibiotic. Ooh, nice. Got it. Do you need a booster shot after this? <laughs> Probably. All right, let's do the eleven letter word. His start is trustworthy, and then space flight. All right, um, got that H in the same spot. All right, we got this C here. It's tough to get word pairs when you're at 11 plus. Um, ooh, okay, so right, let's look at what letters we've got. So we've got S U E O O I H. Okay, um, that's a lot of. We have most vowels, but just no A's. Um, there's probably an S H going on somewhere. I wonder if it ends in like I S H or something. Um, I don't know if it would. Let's see. So, un. Uns. Wow, the stress where the state space fight didn't try the N, so there might be N's in here. Unscooch. Unscooch. <laughs> I don't know. 
we're trying it. Um, okay, so that's an S. Okay, we got et. Ooh, shoot, I went back. Okay, so darn it. All right, trustworthy. I hit the back button on my mouse. Space flight. And what did I do? I did unscooched. Unscoot. Scooched. That's what I did. <laughs> I remember. All right, that's S, C, and S. Um, I wonder if it's an SCH type deal. Like, oh, there's one O. I was going to say school, but there's also no O. There's no L, sorry. Um, un, there's one O. I like the O there, but it doesn't have to be. What about like, or what will we do here? Un, oh, this can't be O. Yeah, H, H, it can't be O, but H, I maybe, or H, E? Oh, schedule, sched, I'm going to guess, yeah, it can't be, sched, I'm going to guess it though anyway, let's do boo schedules, <laughs> just trying that U there, new letter, all right, S-E-H, that's an, I was right about S-E-H, this isn't E or O, so let's try the I then, um, could be a U as well. Just looking at what else we had here. In fact, the U needs to go somewhere. Um, maybe like schism. Schism is. <laughs> schism is. Uh, and then let's try. Oi, schism is. Okay, we're getting progress. <laughs> Thank you for the infinite guesses. Um, Ooh, what letter goes here? It could be a repeated letter, of course, um, but it can't be S, U, or O. Um, I doubt it's an E. So could it be one of the letters we haven't used? Like vis, vish, or is it a repeated? Oh, it could be the M. The M is in the word once. Mish, mish. Whoa, what the heck is this? Okay, Mish Mish uh, Need the O and the U. Mish Misha moves. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, is it mischievous? it's mischievous. I could have gotten that. Oh wait. Mi mischie how do you spell that? Mischie Vus. <laughs> Hold on. Mischievous. There's an E there for some reason. Okay. How mischievous of you, indeed. That was tough. All right. <laughs> Doing some weird fillers here. All right. 12 length. So we've got thoughtfully crack brained. All right. Ooh, <laughs> didn't get much out of that. There's two L's. Um, It's not ING or anything like that. Let's see. There is a G, though. I want to do like a NGS here, and then we'll do, let's see, mill, let's see, maybe, maybe like, let's use another S, like si sil, 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 kemings, <laughs> I don't know. Just trying to put letters where I think they might go. All right, so E-N, it's not E-N-G, though. It's E-N something else. Maybe there's another E here, and we could do, like, there's no S in the word. Okay. Maybe E-N-C-E -E might make sense. Um, Do we want to keep that those L's together? I'm not sure. We could. Uh, we could do, like, a like a G-L, like a um, gl glit, lick, and then end in lens or something. Glyce, Glyce villains. <laughs> okay, no. Um, okay, so we've got I E N C E, and then we've got. Okay, we're we're running out of spots for these L's, so maybe it's a double L here. Um, 
elegance or something. Um, there's a T. Um, we'll just do like, yeah, how many E's are there? There's at least three E's. Um, intelligence, intelligence. There we go. These long words are hard. We're, we're, we're getting larger. What intelligence you displayed? All right, maybe. <laughs> I did guess Sil Silisemengs and Glissevillens. We're getting it, but there we go. All right, 13 length. Untrustworthy. And then enfranchising. All right. Uh, wow. Okay. So we've got an R. We've got the I, I here. We've got a Y at the end. So maybe it's like I, T, Y since we have a T. Um, maybe illity. Um, I like like cap something like capability, but uh, that doesn't quite work. But yeah, I don't know. Um, it could be ability though. Easily. Um, something like rod ability. Um, to, tor, to, Todd rod ability, clearly. Ooh, close. R O, and then ability was correct. Um, oh, we already used the T, and then there's not another one. Okay, I was like, how are the, both of those T's great? But it's, it's all the way over here. So, what goes here? Rope ability? Um, what do I know about repeated letters? Not a whole lot. We know there's only one O. Okay, so we've got to we've got to use A's and I's if, at all. Um, maybe like A I error. Uh, like ve ver. Did I try double R? No, ve vero. Ability, I don't know. All right, there's a P. So, oh, there's not another A. Maybe pro or pro. Wait, what is this? It's so obvious once you think of it, but until then, it's like a mystery. Um, rom ability, rock ability. Like what else could repeat? Robability? Oh, probability. Wait. So what what are we putting first before probability? Um improbability. There we go. Got it. All right. Two more to go. What's the probability of you reaching here? Well, because I can guess nonsense, it helps a lot. <laughs> All right, 14. So we've got Non synchronous. Wait. Oh, you wait. Non synchronous. There we go. And then alphabetarians. All righty. Ooh, lots of info here. We have the A and the N. <laughs> I don't know where anything else goes. Um, Uh, are we ending an ing? Maybe we could. We could end an ing. So let's try that. That that helps fill three of the letters. I love it. Um, <laughs> a app. Let's see. What else? What can we do here? Apologizing. <laughs> Sorry. Had to. Okay. It doesn't end an ing uh, at all. Um, doesn't go a p a l. It could be like an an anthro. Pro my sin. <laughs> I don't know. I tried. Um, okay. I didn't really try that hard, did I? All right. A and N are in place. Still, we have one N and we found where it goes. So that's good to know. Um, a amorphic blob. 
Bins. I don't know. I didn't. I don't know. Why I put an S there. There can't be an S there. All right. We got <laughs> the N. The N. Um, so it's not O L P N or M. So maybe A T T. Like a T. No, we can't do another T though. Um, Athena. Bliss. I'm just gonna get some new letters there. <laughs> Darn it. I, I can't get any more greens. What's going on here? Um, I can't find the second letter for the life of me. Uh, so it's it's probably not I A E, although maybe it could be. There are some A E words. It's not T A I. Maybe I could try A I. So like A. I feel like I'm just gonna try all the letters I haven't tried yet, and then we're gonna we're gonna try to find the L. We're gonna try to find what goes at the end of this word. Maybe an E at the end. And then we got to find where this I goes. So we'll try two I's to see if there's two I's in the word. And then let's do like O, P, and then another I there. Oh, no, there wasn't an I there. Darn. Wow, still didn't get any greens. Okay, so we tried every letter. We know all the letters that exist in the word. The second letter is either an E. It's not T, I, O, P, S. Could be an S. It's hard to use all this info. Um, maybe ASS. So like, oh, it doesn't end in E. That's actually interesting. So it's not an S or an E. N T then. Uh, maybe ent. Ascending. Uh, I'd, I'd like to use the letters that actually exist, if I can. Um, a sec. Clip point. I I don't want to use these in the same place. I've tried them. Clo. Um, probably meant, right? Let's just try this. All right, I'm going to have to scroll. <laughs> All right, it does end in meant. I got an S as well. All right, what is what the heck is this now? Second letter we still haven't discovered. Is it an A-E word then? So E is possible. Is there another E? There is not another E, so E is not possible. Um, I tried T, I tried I, I didn't try, I tried O, tried P, it could be another A, I guess, but S, no, H, I haven't tried H there. It could be a C as well. Maybe it's like ACC. Um, what goes here? Not an O or an I, it could be another A then. Summent? I don't know. Is, would there be something else that could go here? I don't know. I think it's got to be, it's not O or I. It could be S E M E N T. So cement. No, there's only one E. So I think it has to be an A. Summent. Acclimat cement. I don't know. Okay, it is A C C. All right, we got we to gotta scroll more. A C C and then S. M E N T. This is not E. I tried E a couple times. Um, it's not an L. It'd be an O. A ca a, a a call. This isn't an A. I thought I wanted to guess an E there. No, there's not another E. So it's not E A. Could it be I? No. Not I O, so it's not a vowel. Not A E I O. Maybe maybe an A H. I haven't tried H there yet, right? No. A call. You know if there's more than one L? Not sure. Oh, accomplishment. There we go. Oof, tough one. That was an accomplishment though. <laughs> What an accomplishment. Finish here. All right. 15 letter word. Let's see what crazy stuff I guess on this one. So conscientiously. Oops, I spelled it wrong. Hold on. Conscientiously. Oh, hold on. Try again. C-O-N-S-C-I-N-E. There we go. Conscientiously. I missed the C, I think. But yeah, I don't know. And then anti-materialist. Alrighty. So we have the N in place and it ends in L Y. 
We got a lot of letters out of that. Actually, there's surprisingly a lot of letters that were not covered by that start. I wonder if there's a better start for that. Um, maybe an un un um. Let's get some of these letters we haven't tried. Um, un un d. I want to use an R so badly. Um, on Dex Ch um, let's just do this. Maybe, maybe I can do like an Uffly or something. Oops. Uff. Uffly. Um, undenti Undenti Fluffly. <laughs> Okay, it does start with un. At least I got that. All right. So there's only one, only one U. So we we found all the U's. We don't need to worry about U anymore. Um, no G H. Okay. Un. Un what? Un. Will. I don't have that many letters. We gotta repeat a bunch. Could have more O's. There's one A. No, yeah, there's one A. There's two T's. At least two T's. Um, there's one U. One two I's. Maybe U. Uni, I don't know. I'm just gonna guess random things. Un, un, uni, uni. I don't want to do like universe, but it, there's a lot of those letters are gray, so maybe not so good. Um, what are, what are we doing at the end here? Are we doing like an L L Y type thing? Um, maybe like anomaly or something. Anol that's not how you spell anomaly though. Uh, anoli. Uh, an anili. Univor. Bow. Tanili. <laughs> Okay, Yuna is correct. All right, we got some letters right. This is O N L L Y. Um, so it's O N, not I L L Y though. So it's not I or U. O. There's only one O, so that's the only O. So there's only one O and only one U. So it's probably an A, Anali. And then Yuna. There's two T's that I have to use. So like. T here and T here. I want to try unintentionally. Wow, I figured it out. <laughs> All righty, and that's it. Congrats. Yes. <laughs> Luckily, the the option was on that allowed me to guess random nonsense because otherwise there was no way. <laughs> Okay, cool. Re really nice gauntlet of puzzles there. Um, all the words were fair, just it's hard when you get to these long words for sure. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this puzzle and um, definitely thank you again for being a super supporter for 25 months the asylum. Um, each super supporter can submit um, a puzzle to me, um, targeted about a 30 minute video. This actually worked out well. Um, and uh, I, will, I will do the video once per month. Um, so that's awesome. Uh, thank you, the asylum. And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this, why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.